Ladies and gentlemen, today we're going to be playing Paper Mario and a Thousand Year Door. The remake that just recently came out in 2024 is back 20 years later. Once on the GameCube, now on the Switch. This is the wrong controller. Okay, so this came out on the GameCube, there's hella playthroughs, but the last time I seen a playthrough was when I was a wee little kid back in New York. Maybe even high school, my first years. So, I hear this great reviews. People don't know if it's a remaster or a remake. That means it must be at the same quality it once was. So, what perfect time to play it right now? Let's enjoy it. In the beginning, file one. I might as well stream the entire journey, you know? We got the Twitch set up there. I could see YouTube comments here in case I miss anything. Ahem, today I'm going to tell you the story of the Thousand Year Door. An awfully long time ago. In a strange and far off land, a big bustling town or something. It was a town where all people lived very happy lives. It was said that the town was very prosperous. But one day, tragedy befell this blessed place. A great cataclysm struck the town and its people. Darkness filled the skies and the earth roared and shook. It was as if the very world had come to a violent end. And in but a single night, the town sank into the depths of the earth. Many moons rose and set. Stories of the town passed into the pages of fairy tale. And when the town's site no longer held relics of its past, people gathered at that spot and built a new town. A word soon spread among the people who moved in. That the ancient city lay deep underground, and that a magnificent treasure rested there. Indeed, this is the tale of the fabled treasure of Rogue Fort. Yes, this is where it begins, in the sea town of Rogue Fort, the tale of the quest for the legendary treasure. The Thousand Year Door starts here. That's a noose. In a kid's game. <laughs> Finally, I have a minute without Toadsworth watching over me. He's so paranoid, like my mom. I come all the way here on holiday. I don't want to be stuck with Toadsworth. It's so stifling. Once in a while, I like the chance to look around on my own and see what I want. You know, girl things. But now that I'm doing it, all I see is that this town has a very um, distinct flavor. A oh, missy missy. Ah, hooded person. You buy something and have a wide assortment of knickknacks and doodads. This is a special favorite. And that's a pretty box. What's inside it? This box holds a map that shows what a fine treasure. This box has a magic lock on it. It will only open for a pure noble heart. As you can see, it won't so much a budge if one such as me touches it. Oh, the box will open to you, Missy. And you may have whatever is inside. <laughs> Go on, hold it. I was about to go try opening it. Ah, uh, yes, open the box given to you by an old hag. A crackle. A cackle. Ooh, that's like the, the male guy from the first game, right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Mail call! Luigi! Yes! Oh my god! That is my guy! That is my man! 
I am Ralph. Check it out. A letter from Princess Peach arrived for you. I'll just read it to you. How's that sound? Ahem! Now, let's see here. <laughs> Holy shit, her handwriting is bullshit. Hello there, Mario. I am now on holiday, traveling in the Mushroom Kingdom. In my travels, I came into possession of a mysterious map. A treasure map, actually. It was inside a box I got from an old merchant in a town called Rogueport. But since it would be too difficult for me to try to go find treasure all by myself, I thought you could help me hunt for it. You will, of course, won't you? I've included the map with this letter, so please bring it with you when you come. I'll meet you at Rogueport. That means you must come. They will not be cake. Peach. Garrett, let's go. Oh. <laughs> Bro, this is the remake slash remaster. What do you know? It's true. There's a weathered old map in here with a letter. Check it out. That's a shitty ass map. Okay, so there's a town with a noose. There's a bunch of forests. There's trees. Okay. Damn, bro. This looks absolutely beautiful. Paper Mario, the thousand year door. Oh my god. The prologue! A rogue's welcome. You got Mario, you got Peach, you got Bowser, and you got the x -Nort. Excuse me, sir. Please wake up, sir. <laughs> The town you've been speaking of has come into view. Look! That's Rogueport! Damn. That looks pretty shitty. You see, we'll arrive shortly. Please prepare to disembark. Like, the, the graphics look amazing. It just looks like a really bad town. They probably have a high crime rate. Probably worse than Booker. Most likely worse than Booker. <laughs> I must apologize, sir. Our arrival was delayed just a bit by rough weather. Are you quite sure you want to disembark here? I did tell you all the sort of details about Roadport on our way here, did I not? What's that? I'm sorry? You said there's a princess waiting here for you? Is that so? Uh, of course, sir. Well, if that's what you think, then I won't stop you. But, uh, you be careful, sir. Don't say it didn't work. Yeah, that guy's definitely getting mugged. Rogueport! Oi! Welcome to Rogueport, bit of a nasty place. Hey, you got guts coming here. Uh, you look at the green, uh, we did of advice to save, block to save. Because the thing about life is you never know when you're gonna kick the old button. <laughs> True. There we go. Click this block to save all the events you've experienced so far. If you get a game over, you'll start playing again from the title screen. It's within the last button you saved. And then you find a block like this, and you eventually should have hit save. Save! Boom! What do you want, pal? Huh? A princess in a pink dress? I ain't seen nothing like that. No, I remember a princess, probably. What do you want this chick anyway, pal? Owe you money? Or is she your girlfriend? Hey! What do you want? Get away from me, freak! Oh, come off it! I know you're a nosy book nerd, so don't play dumb with me. I've seen you walking around town asking for information about the Crystal Star! Now I'm doing the asking, so be a good little student and tell us what you know right now! Never. I don't have anything to say to you, creeps. Ew! I suppose it wouldn't be right if a sassy little ass like you met with an untimely demise. <laughs> 
boys. We're taking this firebrand to War Fortress. As you command, Lord Strong. <laughs> We're on it. Looks so clean. It really does. No! Stop right there, you weirdos! I'll scream! Really? This is sexual harassment. Like another day in New Jersey. I'm going to go anywhere with smelly losers like you. <laughs> Not likely. Whoop! <laughs> what do you think you're doing, chump? You think you could screw up my plans? Yeah, that's always something. Looks like I'm going to have to give you a little taste of the old crumpet bomb! What the fuck? Okay. First time ever playing, I've never played ever before a Paper Mario RPG. Battle time, Mr. Man. Let's find a way to beat this freak of the week, okay? Don't sweat the details, just jump on in and hit with your hand. Okay. Easy enough. Uh, yeah. Press A at the exact moment you stomp on an enemy. Oh! Sweet, you know that hurt. Wow, gotta say, you're tougher than you look. Keep it up and you'll beat him in no time. Hmm. Hammer! Hold left and release it when the star lights up. Okay. You got him on the ropes! Come on! Keep wailing him! Is there any way to, like, not take damage? Hey! I won! Say less! Got star points. Damn, this was so clean. You did it! You did it! Yes! You got star points! God damn, he bends up. That's what these little things are, are star points. The star points you get will show up there. When you get 100 points, it'll go cool up a level. Don't forget that, okay? okay. Let's go, baby. You got a couple decent shots, and I'll give you that. But, unfortunately for you, that means it's go time. Oh. <laughs> Punish him! Oh shit! That's a lot of dudes. It's like it's looking like a cowboy's during girls' night. God damn! Quick, this way! Oh, wow, they're really bad at their job. Phew, what a bunch of bozos. Let's just sneak out of here. What do you say? Wow, they're really bad at their job. Alexander Reels. Where'd they go, huh? You! Johnson! Did you see them? Did anyone? Jesus Christ. Oh, crud. They bolted. That's a rip. Wow, mister, you totally saved me. Thanks. I've just got to give you a little reward. My name's Goombella. I'm a junior at the University of Goom. Nice to meet you. So, uh, who are you? Oh, yes. Mario? Wait, you mean like, the famous guy? Wow, I can't believe I met you. Cool. Anyway, no offense, but it looks like you just rolled into town yourself, right? <laughs> Is that the fucking Mafia? We gotta move the camera here, give me a second. The Mafia just beat up some dudes right there. 
Me, I already hate it here. There are freaks and weirdos everywhere. It's nasty. Okay, we gotta find a good spot for the camera. Down here, maybe? Yeah, sure. I mean, I know this place is called Rogueport, so I shouldn't have expected it, but sheesh! I've never come to a place like this if there weren't some legendary treasure here. Oh. Peaky Blinders of Mario. What, you're looking for the legendary treasure too? Seriously? <laughs> whoa, 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 bucko. What do you got there? Oh my gosh, is that a map? You have to tell me where you got that. Princess Peach? What? Great Hoogly Boogly! It is Master Mario! Hoo He's back! After like a decade hiatus! I thought this guy died or like was collecting social security checks. Bit of a coincidence bumping into one another in this sort of place. Oh, oh, oh. So tell me, Master Mario, what in the world brings you to this wretched little burg? Oh, ah, indeed. It's a speech sent you a letter and a treasure map. Told you that you meet you here in Rogueport? Intriguing. Hmm, indubitably. Oh, yeah. You're asking me where Princess Peach is? Um, I was about to ask you that. We stopped in this time to acquire a spot of fuel for our ship. On our summer vacation. Don't you know? I only took my eye off her for a moment, but as soon as I did, she vanished. You know how headstrong she is, Mario. I just assumed she'd be back momentarily. But at this point, I fear we must embrace the possibility that she may never return. Usually this guy has like a stroke whenever the princess potentially fucking dies. <laughs> what? I'm feeling better with you, Master <laughs> Mario. Surely we'll find her. Surely. But I know my place, Master Mario, and this is not it. I leave this task to you! I believe I'll recline in the inn right over there and enjoy a spot of tea, perhaps. In fact, I highly recommend it, particularly if you find your HP hard points running low. Just drop on in! <laughs> Yes, anyway, a little rest there will fill all of your HP. I say though, the rest of this town is a bit rough. Yes, rough indeed. Poof, I say. <laughs> um, Princess Peach, did you mean like Peach, the Mushroom Kingdom Princess? The Princess, who always gets mad by Bowser, the Koopa King, the one you rescue. The one you rescue. Wait a second, this is why Princess Peach sent you that treasure map. Well, this is really intense. Well, where could she have gone? Do you think... You think maybe she got sick for waiting and went to find the treasure on her own? Hmm, maybe. <laughs> I know, Mario, come with me. One of my professors is here researching that treasure. We'll show him your map. If we start looking for that treasure, then maybe we'll find some clues about Princess Peach. Great. Well, good then. Let's go, Mario. Goombella, join your party. Let's go. What does Goombella do? Goombella's abilities. A primer. When you approach people or objects, you may see an icon X appear over Goombella's head. If that happens, you can press X to learn more about that person or object. Press X to learn about a person. That's Gunther, the Goomba. He's always complaining about being swindled or mugged. He does look like a buggable person. Let's see here. Press X to get information about nearby people, places, and objects. Press X to learn about a location. This is Rogueport Square. It's the center of town and the main business district. It's a crossroad. Where many people meet, including more than a few shady characters. Sometimes you learn some interesting tidbits. Try using her ability word whenever you can. That concludes this little primer. Do you think you've mastered Green Belly's abilities now? I've mastered them. I think I've got it. Chill. Of course, Green Bella could 
quite helpful in battle too. So you can jump to attack with a head bonk or look up enemy HP and weaknesses with her tattle ability. Ooh. First off, we gotta go find my professor. Thing is, since I got to town myself, I um don't actually know who he looks. His name is Professor Franklin, he looks like this. Oh, before I forget to mention it, from here on, if you ever feel lost or confused, try pressing ZL. That'll be my cue to share the info, I know, which might help us figure out what to do next. Study in page all. Let's look for Professor Franklin, I know where you live somewhere in town. Um, uh, yeah, that's really helpful. The rogue part means spoiler sort of central town, I guess, or a lot of working campers. Veterans of back alleys will be ready to deal with some nasty swords. What is this area? It's a cook shop. But there's nobody in here. Freeze! You two, not another step. Don't come this way. Some complete jerk just bumped into me and made me lose a contact lens. I'm looking for it right now, so don't you dare move. You hear me? Whatever you do, do not move an inch. Not an inch, you hear? And here you stepped on in my core contact lens. I told you not to move. Don't your stupid ears work? What were you thinking? This is your fault now. Let's buy a new contact lens, but you're gonna pay for it. Compensate me, Mr. Clumsy. Fine. If that's your plan, then here's mine, you oak. I'm gonna block the gates to the west side until you bring me a new contact lens. I'm fine with that. So this is the noose. Why don't we just have a random noose here? You. Look, you don't own uh, nothing, so I'll teach you something. How about that? If you press R, you can check the current health. I can't believe you didn't know that. If you have low HP, you order rest in an inn so you recover. Use your head. Oh, what a dear party. I'm pressing the wrong button. Goombella. I only got Goombella. Gear. And art gallery. What is this? Go for sound gallery. Well, Professor Franklin. Actually, I think the guy by the name lives over on the east side. Just go east from here as you enter town from the harbor, just hang a right. So, uh, what about him? Did this guy steal something important from you or what? Yeah, we're gonna go mug him. We do love mugging professors. Oh, I need to go through the actual alley. Ah, bandit! Pardon me, sucker! Hey, what's your beef, pal? Yeah, I'm talking to you! Yo. Boombella's a New Yorker. Living in a New Jersey world. Guy bumps into you and just runs off like that? Unbelievable. Some people are so rude. You probably just took the map, didn't you? Ah, Professor! Oh, hi, there you are. Professor, uh, Professor Franklin, yeah! Wow. What's up? Who? Who's there? Who wants me? Ah, the girls from the club! Ho <laughs> oh, ho! Ah, yes, you! Now you are! Uh... Wait for it, just a moment. Don't tell me now. Silence, I'll get it right. Um, it's not Goombriel. Uh, it's not Elizabeth. Damn, this guy knows hella lady. Hmm. Ah, I've got it! You're Goombella, aren't you? You were in my archaeology class last year, am I right? Wow, yes sir, and that's me. I'm Goombella Jr. and you Goom. Go Goombas! She's definitely in a sorority. Of course, I remember you not to toot my horn, but I'm pretty good at remembering. 
You, though, you stick out of my mind because you're such an exceptional student. And that guy behind you is... <laughs> Mario! Professor, he's Mario. You know the famous one? The one that slaughtered many of our kind? Oh, my apologies. I'm such a bookworm. I haven't a clue about what's fit right now. <laughs> Professor Frankly is definitely a Republican. In any case, what sort of errand brings you two all the way to a place like this? We're hoping you tell us about the legendary treasure said to be below Longport. I thought if anyone knew anything about it, you would, Professor Franklin. Of course I know about it. The reason I came here was to study that very subject. But what do you tights want to learn about the legendary treasure? You know, at most say it's a little more than a fairy tale, don't you? Archaeologists and historians have to search for truth in those fairy tales, though. Me? I believe the legendary treasure truly does exist, and I really want to find it. Good point. And well made! In that case, I'll cooperate with you however I can. First of all, we should start by addressing just what the legendary treasure is. Some say it's an infinitely vast treasure hoard, while others say it's a magical item. Some books say it's actually a monster, while still others claim it's an empty chest. So many different theories, obviously it's impossible to divine the truth among them. But all agree on one point, to find the treasure, one must have the Crystal Star! Crystal Star? To find the treasure of yore, take the seven crystal stars to the thousand year door. That's how the old saying goes, with a rhyme that solid, it must be true. Therefore, if you want to find the legendary treasure, you must collect the seven crystal stars. Oh hey, I researched some of the written lore behind the treasure and it kind of matches that old saying. Hold the magical map, a look before the entrance to the thousand year door. And the stars will light the way that leads to the stones of yesterday. The stones of yesterday? Is that referring to the same crystal stars you've mentioned? It must be in Warren Luck, it's one of the thousand year doors located somewhere beneath this very town. Yet the critical piece of the puzzle, the magical map, is lost. If only we had that map. But we do have it, Professor. Or, well, not we exactly. Mario has the magical map. What? really? You actually have it. Could I just take a quick look at it if you don't mind? Whoa! Great googly boogly! Astounding, this is it. The real thing. The one and only magical map. You, son, are a hero. You're great, fantastic, wonderful even. With this map, you can locate the crystal stars just by holding it up to the front of the thousand year door. Right on, Professor. Good God, what are you doing just sitting here then? Goombella, Mario, let's take the magical map to the thousand year door. Off we must go this instant! I'll lead the way to the sewers underneath the town. Lead the way, King. That you didn't know this rotten old thing came all fitting you. Huh? We can use this pipe to get down under the city streets! Come on, both of you! Let's get moving! Can you jump with A? Is that Papa? Oh wait, hang on a second. Mario, something just occurred to me. I'm fairly certain there are quite a few hoodlums below. So, uh, keep your guard up. Would you two like to practice your action commands before we descend and basics of battle? Uh, yeah, sure, action commands. I don't know what that is. Cool, in that case, let's have a little practice session. Goombella, you could be Mario's opponent. Cool. What? Me? Are you serious? Oh, gee, um, okay, I'll do my best, I guess. First, we'll practice the jump command. That's okay with both of you. Choose the command, then choose which enemy you'll attack. We gotta go hit a woman! Yeah. And choose the 
the command, the answer is going to go from the bottom of the screen, and the dog is press the exact moment you hit him. Well, you got a nice rating, and the action command was a success! Succeeding your action commands will increase the damage you deal to your opponents or do other good stuff. Now it's your turn to attack King Bella, shake a leg! Shake with your mama gave you, Mario, press A just before your enemy strikes you. Okay, here goes Mario. Oh! Okay, so I blocked full damage. You pulled off a guard action command that will decrease the damage you receive from attacks. This match may long just clean off. Success requires timing. Action commands change depending on the attack. Press the same your toes there. Eh? Anyway, let's try this. The hammer action command. Have to get closer to the opponent. Tilt L to the left and release when you see the flash. Okay, perfect. Say less. Stop there! So you got feel, Mario. You got a good grasp on action commands now. How do you feel with physical abuse? Or what do you call it? Domestic abuse? I feel like Chris Brown right now. Thank you, Professor Franklin. This time, press B at the exact moment the enemy attack lands. Try to attack Mario one more time. You got him, Professor. Too soon. Oops, you failed the super guard. Try to press B with the entire timing and guard. Now then, Umbella, try to attack Mario once more. Too soon. What? So you turn the close attack back on him? I mean her! That's a super guard! So you do a super guard with B, take no damage, and damage your enemy in return. But super guards are harder to do than the standard A guards. Choose wisely between them. Oh, shit. Ooh. That's... That's interesting. I have a choice between taking less damage or taking no damage at all. But getting a super guard is almost basically impossible. Pop <laughs> the pipe and press A to enter! Oh, it's like crumpling the little paper as it switches over to the thing. Oh, yo! Rogue Port sub level 1. Let's see. Who's that guy? That guy's a little bit weird. What's in here? Oh, hey. What up, dude? <laughs> ah, welcome, Mario. I am her lovely, the lovely fortune teller. Seeing what my amazing abilities, that which you seek, is my humble job. The light of the shining stars will light that which I wish to see. Aha! So, do I see something for you? Hmm. I don't know what any other stuff is. Aha! Is that so? Well, if there's ever anything you want to find, just ask. I can't go over there. I can't break that. So what do I do? So this is not the way. Hmm. Hey man, what's up? You think it's cool just to wall your way into our underground? Ooh, the Goombas. Typical. Who searches level snobs are oh, so stuck up? Oh, I get to see the sun. I like to breathe cool air. Oh. Huh, yeah. Come on over here, scruffy mustache man. I'm gonna teach you some proper manners. Leave them alone. Can you two academics and a world-famous hero wander the sewers of a port town in peace? 
but this is your usual greeting to visitors and you must have learned it down here because it stinks. Ouch, that was cold. What, you too good for a fight? If you ain't looking to tussle, then stay out of the sewer. Nobody doesn't start a fight with us. Nobody! Let's get him. Okay, let's see what we can do. <coughs> Oi. Let me see if I can find a drink. Ooh. All this talking has got my voice uh, a little bit sore. Good thing I have an unusual amount of power rages lying about. A Goomba, a spiky Goomba, and a Paragoomba. My, the whole Goomba family tree. The only one I should warn you about is that fellow in the middle, the spiky Goomba. So that spike in his head? Well, jump on that and you're the one who will take damage. The Paragoomba is airborne, so your hammer won't reach. You'll have to jump for him. You know what I'm saying? Study your opponent before you choose an attack method. And be ready for those tricky action commands while attacking and blocking. Now, go get him! Oh, that's right. I have to tell you something vital. If you press Y to change the order, you two attack him. If you attack first, if you feel like a Goombella, don't forget that. I'm just over here watching the two of you do your thing for the safe distance. Good luck. Uh, so we switch over with Y. And then let's tattle. But A wants curses inside the circle. Okay. Read up on him. We pulled his IP. Let's see. That's a Goomba. Come um, yeah, I'm one of those, in case you hadn't noticed. Uh huh, it says the Goombas are underlings of underlings. No standout features are known. That's totally cool. Maximum HP is 2, attack power is 1, and the defense is 0. Oh, I kind of get that underling thing now. And his end of history is interesting. Let's go beat him up. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Oh, can I not block? I am not doing a good job. Let's read up. Let's go. Boom. He took his IP address. That's a spiky Goomba, a spiky headed Goomba, what a creative name. Maximum HP is 2, attack is 2, and defense is 0. Guess that spike helps boost his attack compared to the average Goomba. The addition of the spike means you'll hurt your feet if you jump on it. Uh huh. Okay. I feel like the hammer is much easier to. How do you. Can you not, like. Switch where I want to attack. Damn. Wow. Oh. I keep hitting it too soon. Okay. That's not good. Okay. Paragumbo. Boom. Perfect. That's a Paragumbo. Basically, Goomba with wings. I'm jealous. That's an HP is 2, pack is 1, defense is 0. You can hammer it while it's flying, but rough enough with a jump and I'll pull you from it. It loses its wings. Don't have to come over to Goomba for the rest of its life. No one ever talked to us. Okay, so. Oh, perfect. This music is so high. I actually. Oh, fuck, I'm getting attacked. Headball. Oh, actually. Let's have Mario up front. And then let's attack it. Boom. Perfect. This is. Yeah, I mean, this music is pretty dope. I'm not gonna lie. I kinda like it. Owie! Money! Yo, just mugged like three random fellas. Huh. Later on, losers, that felt awesome. Are you ready, Mario? There are plenty more where they came from. They all have it first. 
to me attack, got a hammer diamond jump on them while in the field. Successfully, you need to perform a first strike when you enter battle. If an enemy catches sight of you, be sure to thump him as you go into battle. Can we go in here? We can. What's in here? Oh, shit. Couldn't get the first strike. I guess that's fine with me. Ah, Goomba and a pair of Goomba. Let's go beat him. Boom, perfect hit. Boom. Absolutely destroyed. Let's get it. So you gotta be like, focused on this RPG. Oh, we can look up a bit. There we go. Oh. I have to turn off uh, Xbox notification. Wait, so did I hit him? I hit him with a, a shell. Okay, whoa, 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 yeah. There we go. Boom, one shot. What did we get there? It was like a thing. Okay. Our star points, we got six. Oh, mushroom, a feel good mushroom replenishes 5 HP. You got an item. You could use items to attack enemies to replenish your HP heart points. Press the D pad to open the menu, then choose items from your gear screen to see what items. Okay. Ooh, I saw first, let's go. Ooh, destroyed. One tap. One more jump. I don't think I got it right the second time, but I did get it right in the first time. It's more. We have nobody in the audience yet. I don't know what that means. I saw enemies with fireballs that do three damage and burns them. Interesting. What is this? Oh! What is this? Like? I don't think that does anything. So be it. Ooh, there's a big box. Who's that? Whoa! Huh? Whoa! God damn it. Are these guys 3D now? Huh? Yeah, I think they are. There's two, so let's try and jump on him first. Oh, they got more than two HP. That's interesting. Yeah, spinning it. Okay. That's a spinia. Holy really weird creature made of thin, papery boards. It certainly looks unique. Nobody knows much about these creatures, actually. Max HP is three, attack is one, and defense is zero. Its attacks are super swift, but it should be pretty easy. Just give it a hey -ya! Oh, that's way too swift for me, apparently. Oh, there we go. Okay, so. Boom. Head boom. Oh shit. I've never been prepared when they actually hit. You got star points. Hey, six more. Let's go three. We need what? 57 more in order to get a level up? That's pretty good. We got the healer. Hmm, I don't think we would do anything with that. But there's a giant. Okay, boom. Let's get it. Let's jump on it. 
go. Get in the attacks down. Get guarded. Bonk. Let's go! Big dogs, big dogs. Up there. How do we even reach it? Oh, there's paper. Yeah. I don't. How do you get past all these like paper things? I, I want to like just rip it all. Mom, how are we doing? We're playing some Paper Mario. I got the black key. That must mean you're the hero of legend. Huh? Only the great hero of legend can hear my voice. Yeah, everyone else. Nothing. Oh. See, long ago, I'm evil spirit. It's a curse on me, locking me in this chest. It's a real drag. I've been here ever since, waiting a long, long time for a hero to come on by. So, yeah, uh, anyway, big guy. What brings a hero like you to a place like this? Her Mario, where's the hero? I'm not exactly confident in it. We should trust this chest. It may be best not to mention that we're looking for the crystal stars. Well, Drat. I just said it out loud. What's wrong with you? Oh, yes? Yeah? Looking for the crystal stars, are you now? So you really are a hero. Well, you're definitely gonna need my help if you hope to get those bad boys. So, first you should look for the key to open this chest and use them to let me out. Definitely. Not sure how this chess guy would know you can go to Crystal Stars. What do you think we ought to do? Mm. Well, I know my vote goes to you. If I need my key, I'm sure it's around here somewhere. This is what the key looks like. Uh, by the way, come on. Things in this box. There's no picnic. I'm counting you. I'm counting on you, oh great legendary hero. Ah. Mm hmm, yeah, great. Whoa, what? You already found the key? Oh man, I need you big. Ah, uh, sure, let's use it now. Let's go on. Yes! Thank! Ha! Thank nothing. <laughs> Ooh! What is it? What? Oh boy, you fool for it. I burned you! What, you think I was gonna help you? Instead, I'm gonna spread a little of the suffering I've endured in that stupid box! Yeah, sorry, but those are actually the breaks. I'm gonna cast an evil turtle curse on you! Boogly woogly woo! You're cursed! Oh shit, I actually am. <laughs> Enjoy that curse, sucker. You got what you deserve. You wanna hear all about the sweet curse I just dropped? Then listen well. From now on, if you press Y in certain areas, it will turn into a paper airplane. We hate trembling yet. So for the rest of your days, look at my terrible curse! <laughs> oh, I can't help but chortle. You're doomed! This curse is pretty rough, I guess, so I suppose I owe it you to explain it. Or I owe it to you to explain it. Ready? Send an airplane panel like this one, the floor will start to glow. Oh. Uh -huh. Yeah, okay, you're on the panel. Now, try pressing Y and then BAM! You're a paper airplane. Control the tiny paper airplane itself by tilting L, throw it in the back. The plane will rise and tilt it L in the direction behind you. If you're tilting L too much, you'll fall down and start to fall back to the ground. If you start to rise, stop tilting L, time is key, try an L, stop the total aerodynamic. And you bet. Humiliation. Okay. Ah, paper airplane. <laughs> when you've had enough 
paper airplane shame. Press B to deep plane and get back to normal. So be honest, do you fully understand the perilous curses bestowed upon you? Yes, I do. Farewell, you foolish fool! <laughs> That's it? Okay, I assume that was a plus. So, uh, wow, just wow. What was that guy's beat? So. Oh shit. Oh fuck. God damn it. This is what the box meant. L L for winter back to steer your um paper airplane cell. Would be a good pilot if you want to fly far? Try once more. Damn, I suck. Say what? Ooh, the thousand year door. Oh, Mario Kubella, look at that. Great googly boogly, is that the thousand year door? I can't believe it, it's real. So the legends are true, come, let's move closer. Professor, what's going on? The map. It's doing map things. We're downloading Siri. The GPS signal. That. That looks pretty decent. Oh, what is it telling us to do? Oh, it's telling us to go to a castle? That's a interesting castle. Oh, there's a star there. Yeah, sure, let's get it. The location of this crystal star has been recorded on your magical map. And Mario has learned a special move. You can now use Sweet Treat. Is there any, like, a crystal star for that? Professor, the map. And what was with all those strange lights? Huh. This looks like information related to the location of a crystal star. And that shining light looked as if a mysterious power was given to Mario. Well, one way or another, we should return to my place and study the map closely. Oh, yeah. Let's see here. Jokel, thank you for joining us. Thank you for following. Let's see here. Hmm, aha, uh -huh, I see. You understand it, Professor? Of course I do, and I shall explain. The first thing I know is the map is truly astounding. Somehow, this map contains radar-like functions. It's showing us a location of a crystal star. It looks like the first crystal star is to be found in a place called Petal uh, Meadows. Petal Pet Meadows, yeah, there. Petal Meadows? Yes, the area is a vast meadow that lies far to the east of Rogue Pool. Telling the truth, I've always thought that place was a bad suspicion. The name Petal Meadows did come up from time to time in my research. Okay, fine. So we'll go there. Does anyone know how to get there or what? I'm fairly certain that somewhere beneath the city is a pipe to Petal Meadows. If you could just find that, we'll get there instantly. I travels efficiently. Say, by the way, Molly, I'm curious. How do you get on map anyway? Princess Peach, really? Her Highness sent us to you? It's Princess Peach. This wouldn't be her, would it? Oh, yeah. 
so it is her. Your princess came to see me the other day. She wanted to learn about the treasure. I told her about the crystal swords and my suspicions about Petal Meadows. It doesn't seem likely, but perhaps she found to go to Petal Meadows on her own. You know, Professor, I want another suspicious group asking about the same thing. Hmm. I can't imagine Princess Peach getting involved with that. Alright, it's it. Off to Petal Meadows. You two go. If Princess Peach indeed went there, your first priority must be to catch up to her. Collecting crystal stars is a means to an end, and that end is Princess Peach. Getting the girl. Amen. Aren't you coming, Professor? No, I'll stay in town and ask about Princess Peach and that suspicious game. This Goomba is definitely getting shot in an alley. Besides, I doubt a shriveled old Goomba like me could handle the trials of the road. Of course, if anything happens and you need some advice, come see me, okay? You got it, Professor. Well, Mario, we're off. Give it your best. Now then, allow me to give you both a proper farewell. Ah, Mario, there's something I forgot to mention. Firstly, about that light you saw shining on you. By my reckoning, Mario can now perform what is known as a special move. A special move? Yes, it will. Stuff like this is better explained by example rather than words. Would you like to try it out? Sure, why not? Excellent, in that case, let's give you a special move a little test run. First, take a close look at your star powered gauge. Oh, I got a new gauge. Let's see that the gauge has one power gun. Obviously, that's a single unit of power. So you're sitting on a single dot of star power with me so far, and when you have star power available, you can do a special move. Try using Sweet Treat now. The special move that will replenish your HP and FP. Special. And yeah. So, let's do... Oh. So, I didn't realize you had to just tilt left multiple times. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I'm pretty bad at it so far, but I'll get better. You can use one power dot, but star gauge is now empty. You can the gauge empties out though, you can still charge it up again. That's why the audience watching the battles is very important. Let's go! Yeah! If you get the audience excited, you'll build up more star power. Let me show you what I mean, Mario. Can you try to attack me, please? Nice! See that? You throw the audience, so they filled up some of your days. How do you do stylish things? I know stylish is a good thing, right? Nice! Keep building with that star power. Also, the more exciting your battles are, the more people will come to watch you fight! As you can see, that reflected in the number of members in this audience. Fifteen! Okay! So with me, the more people in your audience, the more star power you get. You can also use the appeal command to get star power. I hope you memorize all this. Well, that's all I've got. Here ends my scintillating lecture on special moves. Fine work, Mario. Let's go. That's a dog. Okay, can I leave now? What is that? Mario, right, it's scary out there. Take this with you. You got a power smash badge. It's called a badge, and it's incredibly helpful. You see, depending on the badges you equip, we'll get much more powerful. What's important is knowing what the effects will be when you first equip a badge. Would you like to practice equipping and removing badges? Yes. I don't know how to do so. 
Okay. Press D pad. Okay. Badger. Takes BP. Press A to. Um, okay. Use one BP. Press A again to remove the bag. Okay. By the way, you need flower points. I could use uh, the power smash. In battle, you should watch not only your HP, your XP too. Did you get all that? Well, there's no thing that you find the piped petal feathers, nether, whatever it's called. Hey there, kid. You got a minute to learn what it means to fight? Like to fight with your whole heart? Yeah, sure. It's a very good potential, kid. But there's a heap of stuff you don't know about a fight. Stylish moves. Hitting it big. There's a whole list. Feel free to hit me up if you got a question, friendo. Who am I? There's some who call me the battle master. I don't stop them. But I could. Go to fighting. Anywho, I got a great life traveling training. Oh, some third thing. If you see me around, give me give me a hug. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, kiddo, you need something from the old battle master? Tell me the secrets of battle. How do you what do you what do you wanna know? Star power and stylish moves. You really want to rack up some star power? Get good at using stylish moves, kiddo. Be able to tell you pull it off by little changes in how the move looks. You could use a tiny tutor dash to show you the A icons. All oh, right. If you want to practice these, hitting bingo using items. So everything is about timing in this game. No, I don't want to practice that. Let's get down to business. God damn it. You open the train up. I'm going to know. You need anything else, kid? No. Gotcha. Give me some time to figure out a few new secrets and come on back whenever. You. Who are you? My name is Dazzle and I collect star pieces. The more I collect, the happier I am. So guys, if you have any star pieces, I'll trade you my badgers for them. Yay! Which badge do you want to trade for? I don't have any star pieces. Hmm. Flower finder? Peekaboo. Item hold. Happy heart. Happy heart. Damn, these are pretty good. I need to get some star pieces. What, you change your mind? Come on! I don't even have star pieces to trade. Man, I get this much ink to make this game. Bro. Oh, I got a plain up. Okay. Oh, it's a Goomba bear. Ooh, what is this? It's kind of soggy and maybe really gross. Bloop! Bloop! Oh, shut sure, up. Big guy. This might not be good. Okay. Holy shit, he's massive. He just up and whacks someone's tootsies like that. Someone gets some serious mozzie, that's who. Can you look at that? It's some saucy mustached guy. He's in a world of hurt. 
Ah, oh, tentacles! Ah, oh, I'm gonna get in the face of their old little trample. Boop, 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 boop. Hey, Mario, you know what Professor Franklin told us, right? You can press Y to change your attack order. Your AP is to drop, so you can press Y to put me in the front. Ah, oh, oh, I can't believe this fight. Ah, what kind of I think I don't think I'll be one shot. Attack, paddle. I can only tattle the blooper. Damn. That's a blooper! And a really super humongous one too. Ew! It's so slimy! Ugh! I, I just totally can't stand it. slimy, nasty, icky things. G-R-O-S-S. Gross. Oh my god, max health is 12, attack is 1, and defense is 0. It attacks with tentacles and ink. Once you damage both its tentacles, it'll fall, uh, fall down, and then it's attack time. By the way, the tentacles each have 3 HP. Now, relax and make some seafood of that slimy, nasty blooper. Hey, what's that? You think me it tastes good? Aren't you? Admit it. Dude, you want a snack in these tentacles, don't you? Uh, again, yeah, no, I'd rather not. Who could be got this punk? What? Okay. He wants to be eaten? Okay. Interesting. Head bump that. Let me see if I could super block this. I can't. Uh oh, that ain't good. Let's see here. Okay, boom. Let's see if we can do the power smash. Hold L to let and release it when it lights up. Okay, yeah. Oh, four damage. Okay, that's pretty decent. One more damage and this man is gone. Oh, he got up. Oh, he must be in the tail end. Okay. Uh, let's finish him here and now. Damn it. Ooh! We beat him! Let's go! Clear bonus 50. I got money. I got star points 20. 69? Say less. Oh! Platforms! You know just fucking died. Ooh! And that is the end of the prologue! Chapter 1, Castle and Dragon. Ooh. You've done it, baby. Petal Meadows. Okay, it might be best if I move my camera to the top right. And then make it a bit smaller so that it doesn't block off anything. Yeah, that should be good. Well, here we are, the Petal Meadows. Where folks say a crystal star hides. Woohoo! Here we go, Mario. Study the adventure. This is completely awesome. Yeah, let's go save. Yeah. Oh, shit. That's not very Oh, my God. 
Not, that man is pretty beefy. Man, ugly. That was a dragon, right? Whoa, what was that? I've never seen anything that humongous before. It looked kind of scary, too. Definitely flew into that castle back there, right? Let's get going in case he comes back. Here we go. Again. Check. Put it in there. But if you put something in there, which will shape it's over here. Okay. That reminds me of a pipe. Hmm. Oh, I got money. Get a mushroom. Oh, shit. Let's see here. Okay, so. We don't have enough FP. So, let's get rid of this guy. Heal. Ooh, she's blowing kisses. Damn, that filled me up. Oh, damn it. This ain't good. I'm low on HP. You got star points. They what? Got a badge, a close call badge. When Mario's at or below 5 HP in battle, those will sometimes miss. Oh, that wasn't the D pad. That was the start menu they wanted me to press. Talk first. Say what? Boom. One shot, baby. Hey! Star points. Very close to our level up. Beat this guy up. Okay, and boom! One shot. Hey, I got him. Six more. Oh, I just got him ready to some volleyball, but I don't have shorts. Oh, uh, what is this though? I don't think I can reach that. Yeah, I can. I might have to come back whenever I get something new. Oh, one more thing, Mario. If you ever find yourself wondering what to do, just press yell after him. Oh, good ideas, you know? Points. Great. The mushroom? Ah, yeah, I think so. Nice. And then we just head bonk this pair of Goomba. Did it. You need a real challenge now. What? Huh? Okay. You got honey syrup. Okay, that's way more than I thought. Oh, there's a start. 
feels like a way you could run. Is this that it? Yeah. That's it on this side. Die here? No, but it, there's nothing there. So I'm gonna hit all these trees or something? Make sure they're all. Yeah. Nothing? Oh, it did! A mystery! Take a chance and find out? Huh? I don't know what that means. Fire flower. Okay, where are we going next? Let's see. Petalberg. What is up, dog? Welcome, travelers. Hmm, where are you, you ask? Why this is Petalberg? Sorry, but it's been a while since we've had visitors here. Yippity, once that dragon hooktail was spotted flying around this area. Well, it didn't help tourism. Put it that way. People just stopped visiting. Dragon, hooktail. That must have been the huge thing we saw earlier, Maria. It was called hooktail, huh? Oh, scary name. By the way, green boots, have you ever heard of these things called crystal stars? On this quest to find them. It's very important. Crystal stars, you say? Mm, no, can't have my eye. Uh, sorry about that. Um, you want to speak with the mayor, though? Ooh, really, really old. As such, he knows all kinds of stuff. Because of his age, are um, very smart. Anyway, the mayor lives in that pink house up ahead. Pink house? It sounds totally hideous. But it should be easy to find. Thanks. There's an inn. You. Oh, Hooktail? She lives at the. Oh, it's a she? Ooh. Have you heard the rumors? Some say a treasure is hidden in that castle. Scores of people have gone in search of it, but not a single one has returned. So, what do you think? You're gonna see it, huh? Who are you? You are ugly. Ah, bonjour, mademoiselle! Isn't it a beautiful day? Oh, no, 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 no. I love you, monsieur. de la moustache. I'm speaking to the lovely little cabbage behind you, Mon Petit Chou. Do you hear me, beautiful? Abandon this bullet and come away with me. Ew, are you kidding me? Ew, nice wig, you kids don't want to be. Take a hike, bozo little chump. Oh, 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 it's this place. I am wounded. Such beautiful honesty, such a sharp tongue. I shall retreat for now. You change your mind, companion. What a total sleaze. Let's go somewhere else, Mario. This is a kid. Hey, what's up? I've been playing a whole lot of GBA games. Like, this is one game that just absolutely rules. It's Fire Emblem. We didn't start off in the GBA. Totally rocked my socks. GBA is back. Fire Emblem 7, yeah, I guess that came out at that time. You're a bomb. What are you doing? Put I'm General White. I'm a bomb. I've lost my hopes and dreams. I live in solitude. Always, I must apologize, but I ask that you leave me alone. My man is definitely a witness to some weird things. Ah! It's a woman Koopa. Hello, my my name is Koopy Koo. It's nice to meet you. Oh my gosh, that hat, those overalls are that magnificent. Lost that. You're Mario, aren't you? Probably oh, somebody knows me. Her tales of how strong you are. Do you hear what I mean? You're going to challenge that monstrous book tale. Oh, if only Koops are as brave as you. Damn. I don't even know who Koops is, but apparently Koops is not the schmoo. That's cool. Huh. What's that? Someone there. Who is it? Who? What do you want from me? Oh, I know you. You're thieves! 
Get a robber defenses, old Koopa. Despicable! Go on, do what you will. You plainly see there's nothing to steal here. I guess I have a little money. Take it. You fiends, my antique shell too. Just leave the photos of me and the missus. Can't do without those memories. What? Not these, you say? Well, what's your story then? Oh wait, when you folks are looking for this crystal stars? Well, why don't you pipe up before you, idiot? You're just wasting time here. The crystal stars you say you're hunting? Um, wait, what did I hear about those dang things again? Aha, got it. Hook thing. Hook tail's got what you're looking for. She's this enormous, fiery dragon. It's folks, they say, you know, hook tail, right? Yeah, 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 of course, yeah. All this hook tail's beautiful fly by snack things have us all on pins and noodles. So are you reckless fools, I mean? Are you gallant heroes off to rough her up? Yeah, you got it, yeah, sure. Oh, whatever. Oh, ho! Sounds promising. Why, if you could rid us of Hooktail, we'll shower you with gratitude and reward. Wait, what's that idea? Can I set no reward? I mean, I didn't say that. What an unselfish man. You're noble indeed. You have a good egg. Now, what did you say your name was again? That's my name. Yeah. Murphy. Hmm, that's a fine name. Yes, a fine name indeed. Well, now, Murphy. Name's Mario. I appreciate that, Murphy. They are nice eyebrows. Now, listen up. Your intent of going to Hooktail's castle, find a secret pipe that's located somewhere in Petalburg, or Petal Meadow. And then you need the sunstone and the moonstone to use that pipe, or stone to somewhere in Schwank. Fortress, go past the village, get them first. Well then, Murphy, get going, really wallop that Hooktail monster. So be it. Schwank. Oh, there's a badge there, but I can't get it. Mm. Cool. Some stone monsters live in the Schwank Forest up ahead, and so we fear it's baby here to keep them out. But if the mayor says it's okay, I'll let you pass. Careful out there, though. Oh, uh, excuse me. Er, I beg your pardon. Wait a minute. Ah, oh, yeah, it's, uh... Uh, yeah, it's Guy. Pardon me for yelling like that. I was panicking. Um, how to begin? My name is Coops. I heard you're traveling to Hooktail's castle. Yeah, this guy is definitely all crazy. I, uh, have a favor to ask. Um, I'll just, uh, just forget it. Never mind, ignore me. Good, goodbye. Okay, that was weird. What do you think's going on inside that guy's shell? Don't know, don't care. I love this game. R Jason. Or R Jensen. Yeah, this is my first time ever playing it, so like Yeah. Let's we'll see what everybody's hyped about. Boom. Easy money. Let's get this. That's a one shot. Let's go. Oh, new guy. Hmm, what do we do? Get the trooper. Oh, that's interesting. That's perfect. Let's go. That's Goopa Troopa. We've been around forever. Gotta respect our longevity. Max HP is 4, attack is 2, defense is 1. Their shells are hard, but flip them over and their defense drops to 0. <laughs> Oi. You don't have to flip them over, right? Yep, jump some cow blocks. So get in there and get stomping. Okay, we gotta heal or something. So well, let's see here. Wow, I really suck at this. Oh god damn it. I got three. 
We're so good at this game, I kind of suck. I don't know about good. I really don't. I was trying to see. Okay. Uh, let's see. Boom. We beat the Koopa Troopa. Let's go. Yeah. Let's more. Oh, wait. Oh. We got a star, we know, get the level up, let's go! Use L to select the stat to increase. Let's increase that speed. BP, BP. Six BP. I barely even have any badges, so I don't think I'll need some more HP. 50 people in the audience, god damn. Shaking bush. Nice job. Oh shit. Whoa. Okay, I can't believe this fight. This is a story battle? Look at our audience. There's a shy guy. That guy has got a rock. There's no way he's gonna throw that at you. He'll get hurt if the audience hits you with anything and not just emotion. Quick, stop him before he throws that rock. Press X. Nice! Wait, you lousy troublemaker. From now on, press X to eject any audience members who don't look like they're holding Or that do look like they're holding things. So make sure you know, the fans out there with items and coins for you, try not to chase them away. Okay, Mario. Try attacking with your hammer. Boom. Oh! Keep up uh, the amazing stream. Thank you so much. Thanks, Bubba. Some of the offensive calls are back up to collapse. It can drop on us too, so watch out. I've seen some other things that happen while you're up here, so stay alert and try to come up on the top. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so we knock them over. Ooh, a super guard! Say less! I'm a bigger fan of the hand than I am the drop. Oh, money. Money. I still don't know if you could run him. Oh, shit. Okay, Goomba and a Koopa. Hmm, actually, let's get him out of here. I don't need the power hammer. Oh, god damn it, I might need the power hammer. I don't know what this does. Oh, I, I guess that's good. Yeah. Go and he gets burned, right? Okay. That's a bit quicker than I would make it stall. I'm always trying to like predict it or something like that. I can't. I really suck at defending. Or attacking. Maybe both. Probably both. Indeed. The power block. Flips all enemies, does two damage. Okay. So this is a Schwank. Schwank Fortress. This almost looks like some cool kind of statue. Give it a good whack with your hammer. Schwank. Oh, I got the first attack. Zero damage. What? Oh, bald cleft. Let's paddle on him. Nice. 
that's a bald cleft. Basically, a rock monster with a sharp, craggly face. Oh, this is kind of mean, but bald guys really just don't do it for me. What's the preference? Backstage 2 is 2, Catholic 1, and Defense is 2. Yeah, this guy is rock out. Fire doesn't even hurt him. Might be best to attack with, say, a power block. Ooh. This. It would be this. Oh, that's interesting. Oh. Okay, let's switch that up. And then. Their defense is two, so the only thing that's gonna work is the power snap. Can I speak? Okay, so well. Now what? The door is open. Ooh. Okay, now let's just jump on my Yeah, yeah, we got the jump. And then we get to disable this guy too. And then let's target one of them. There we go. Okay. Hit bonk him again. Yeah, you're not getting up. Stay down. That's good, we got soft points. Six more HP. Okay, I'm down. We're pretty good. Okay, kind of reaching it. That's a one shot. That's a one shot. And... One shot. Let's go. You got more HP. You can take the hit. That's a Bristol. Only covered in spikes. They're so prickly. Max HP is 2, attack is 1, and defense is 4, and they're impervious to fire. If you're trying to get close enough to whack it with a hammer is dangerous. Seriously, spikes will totally pop out. Since so you can't jump on it or use your hammer, you better use an item. Fire flower. Oh, super guard. Oh, super guard works too. So if I could super guard against them, that could be a good idea. Wants us to use his cow block. Okay. Ah, 14 points. Okay. 
I need more badges. I'm getting a bunch of BP, but I'm not getting enough badges. Hmm. I think the fortress is going to kind of jump. Okay. Whoa, you missed. Boom. Oh, but that doesn't knock him down. You can only choose after it's time to the foe. Boom. Okay. Yeah, but now I can't do anything. The feel, I guess. I don't know. Stock points I don't need. I want to get good at, like, super blocking. If I get super block everything, I feel like I'm going to be in a great position. Ooh, fire flower. What is that, though? An in coupon. A free pass. Oh, okay. Drop first, let's get it. Okay, let's just be true. Yeah. I'm missing everything. God damn it, bro. Okay, we got like hella loot. 4 HP for Mario, we got the full FP. Back to the battle. Damn. Okay, let's go for the power smash. Perfect. And then we head bonk him. Oh, we got two mushrooms. What does that mean? I can't hear you speak over the game. Ah. It's probably just my mic. My mic has to be closer to my face. That? Or I just have to speak louder? Eh, what are you gonna do? I gotta... Not the best kind of shirt on right now. Give me a second. Where is the thing? You know, I'm just gonna see if I can put it in my cooler. And then bend it forward like that. And that should be better. Uh, I'll see if I can... I'll raise up the decibel levels back to zero. Okay. And I have it at negative one, but then sometimes I peak. That should fix the dismal. Who are you? Oh. <laughs> Ooh, ha, ha. You're the first contestants I've seen in a while! You must walk the sun and moon stones, and if that's the case, then you must compete against me. If you win, I'll let you through! Where the stones rest. However, if you lose, you will suffer a terrible fate, and by terrible, I mean dress awful. <laughs> Ooh. So, what do you want to do? I'll take you on, yeah, sure, whatever. <laughs> You're in for it now. Ooh, battle time? Huh? Hey, hey, it's that time again. Welcome everyone to the 65th Trivia Quizzle. What the shit? If you correctly answer five of the following questions, you'll win. Look at three wrongs, you'll suffer. 
Now, for the first question, what's in the Schwong Fortress? The Sun and Moonstone. Yes. Final answer. Show me the money! Yeah. That's correct. That question is too easy, but it makes it harder from here. Much harder! So prepare yourself. On to question two! What do one mushroom and one fire flower cost at the shop in Pillburg? What the fuck am I supposed to know? Ten coins? I never even bought anything. Yeah, no. It's either eight or twelve, maybe? Remember, if you get three wrong, you can suffer like you wouldn't believe. Don't let that pressure get to you. Moving on, question three. What is the name of the mayor of Petalburg? Oh, shit. I don't know his name. Who? Mupa. I don't think it's Mupa. Mupa Koop. Chat, do we know? Bertle? It can't be Bertle, it can't be Mupa. I could, I got no life on it. Has to be Koop or has to be Koop Koop? I feel like it's probably Koopa Koop. We're gonna go with Koopa Koop. What's his name? You blithering meathead, you're wrong again! The one more wrong is something wonderfully awful happens here. Just one more wrong. <laughs> What's that I hear? Your little knees knocking? We're not done yet, folks. Question four. Tell me, where is your crystal star? Hotel Castle. Yeah, that's easy. Yeah, okay. That's correct. That question was too easy. You want to get started from here? Watch hard. So prepare yourself. Are you ready for the diabolical question five? I don't want to get from Rogue for the Petal Meadows. Go through a pipe. Yeah. Green for correct. That's correct! That question was too easy, but you want to get started from here? Watch hard. So prepare yourself. Question six. Which of the following characters can be found in Petal Birds, Koopa Troopers, Goombas, Bald Clefts, Koopa Troopers, Fuzzies? I don't know. I don't even think I've encountered a Fuzzy yet. How am I supposed to know what a Fuzzy is in this game? Yeah, I'll try it again. Tell me, you didn't just get your fourth answer correct? Can't be true? That's it. Making the rest of the game near impossible. Get ready for brain pain. Now for the last question. What number question is this? I've gotten two wrong and four correct. So this is question seven and it says it up there. Super question 64. Okay, that's it. That's the reference. Any real answer? Final answer. Bada bing, baby. No! Wrong! That, that's right! You correctly answered five questions. I don't believe it! You win! What do I win? Show me the money! Okay, that's cute. So, very angry. I can't believe I lost. I guess I have to let you through. Stupid. Yeah, stupid rules. Yeah, okay. What is that? Oh, it's a pipe! Multi bounce badge. BP needed. What is this? Where this use multi bounce? Two FP are required to use this. Oh shit. So now. Fuzzy. Oh hell. God damn it. Oh! Oh, 
paddle jerk. Ah, uh, let's hammer them. That uh, did not work out as much as I, I would have thought. Okay. That's not good. That's a fuzzy. What a hyper little guy, huh? Cut back on the caffeine, bro. Max HP is 2, attack is 1, and defense is 0. Those things suck up your HP and use it to replenish their own. Isn't that the worst? I mean, ew! Doesn't that just sound totally gross? Anyway, it sounds like you need to use the guard action command when they release you. The time is pretty hard to master, so uh, I'll pack this up. These things really suck HP. Hmm. Okay. What? Okay, we beat one. Can we head bonk on them? We can. Okay. He missed again. So he left. Now this one's definitely gonna hit. One, two. God damn. I can only attack losing first. Could be it. I could heal up, I probably have to start from that. Right? Yeah, I do. I do want to practice. And he just dies. Okay, I'm not getting any practice. Oh! Let's go! We got the dub. We got the dub, boys. Huge dub in the chat. Okay, not seriously. I need to find. Button my shirt up. So that this could hear me better. Collared all the way up on a Friday. That is wild. Mmm. That's very interesting. Ah, <sighs> that's not good. I'm still in the yellow. Um. We'll see if we can lower that to minus 14 decibels. Maybe the guy was right. I don't know why I'm not- Whoa, okay. I'm getting stuck. Let me see if I go one-shot him. Because they don't have any defense, right? Yeah, we can one-shot him. What? Is he attacks my miss? What even hit him? Oh, two flowers. We might get some flower stuff. Oh, we got the moon piece. The moon stone. Oh, shit. That ain't good. Okay. Whoa, that's a whole lot of dudes. And they're dead. Well, that was easy. Well, 12 HP. There's 12 XP. 21 people in the audience. That was well managed. Oh, we got a mushroom for it. I'm not gonna use it since we got the sweet treat. Um,
Okay, so I mistimed that for sure. I might have to start pressing A. Boom. That's a big dub. Huge dub. Oh, Fire Flower. Don't mind if I do. God damn it. Green. Might as well. I don't know what that core was, so I'm gonna go and see if I got any voice now. I don't know who that is. Let's increase FP this time. Okay, max HP, max FP. My voice now isn't full, is it? I don't think so. We got the sunstone. Oh shit. Four of these people are gone. Can't do this fight. Do I have any more items? Yeah, I have one more fire flower. Might as well use it. Bada bang! Let's go! Oh, money. I can't say no to money. Another fire flower. Sweet. Okay, so. What now? Let's refresh the track. In case there's a disconnection to Twitch. What the hell is that? Me work. Hey, you suspicious types, this is our place and coming in here is rude, rude, rude. Sorry, suckers, if you want a warm welcome, too bad. Now I lunch on your head. What? What the hell? No, 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 we're not doing this. Absolutely not. Hmm. Do you like tattle on him? Let's do a multi bounce. Yeah. What? What happens to the multi bounce? Perfect. That's a gold fuzzy wound. There's a super rare auxiliary. So wow. Max, max HP is 10, attack is 1, defense is 0. But hey, even though it's a fuzzy, you won't suck up your health. Which is nice. I have to wonder though. How does this thing hide? Look at it. It's so gaudy. What? I need multi attacking multiple foes. Oh, it's not like a continual one bounce, it's a multi attack bounce. That makes a little bit more sense. Me off! Hey, ow! You chunks are tougher than you look! But I'm not through yet. Everyone, get him! What the fuck? Huh? There's a whole lot of guys. Fuzzy Ford. Oh, I should have tattled on him. I don't think I protected myself there. I... I'm... wow. Okay. I'm bad. Yeah. 
I can't even see the actual guy. That is really not good. Let's paddle the fuzzy wood. The fuzzy horde. Look at them all. What a mob scene. The fuzz is a buzz. Max HP is 20! Attack is 1 and defense is 0. Fuzzies come at you all at once and attack in order. It says here not to freak out. It also says that if you're good timing to defend, you won't take much damage. I think you might just be faster than with the wing, the ringleader though, you know? But if we do defeat the regular guy, I think it might be smart. Man, I can't even see my character. Oh, he missed because I have so low HP. Okay. We're gonna defeat this fuzzy horde. Boom, baby. Well, okay. Bingo time. What? We got bingo! Oh my god, I feel like I'm back in New York with a stallion. We got FP! I missed again? Damn. What? What just happened? Okay, power smash is full. I'm in my gamer stance. Let's go. Wait, did we kill him? I think we did. Yeah, we have like a bunch of XP. Damn it. Yes, Graham, get out of here. Let's go down. Can we just like go into the wall? That's definitely interesting. Got the mail. Sound like you got an email. You should check it out. Press plus. You can also check your email under mailbox SP in the menu if you want some folks just like menus, you know? Working hard, blah blah blah. I have nothing more to say than that. I hope all goes well. My man has a book. Should be it. Okay, we gotta heal up. Let's multi bounce to start a rule. No, we can't because the other one doesn't have a special thing. Sweet treat. Except P though. Still out as a plus. Mmm, I should have hit Cooper. Actually, I can't, can I? Damn it. Oh, now I can choose which enemy I want to hit? Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, well, let's bring out the power smash. Boom, baby. Let's get it. Huge build, six points. We are getting experience.
Ooh. Oh. Okay. Let's drop first. Oh, that guy has a fire flower. Okay, so multi bounce is definitely better for enemies when they stack up to like three or four. But anything else, eh, it's not really worth it. Money. God damn it. These poopers. That's so one shot on my bat. Oh, I don't get the money. That's something I wanted. Oh no! And the guy left because I hit him. Okay, so we reduced the amount of damage I took there. Let's just jump on them like this. We can reduce whatever damage we could be taking. Yeah, that's, that's what we're gonna do. Okay. Half the Schwong Fortress. Boom, struck first. You're not getting me this time. One shot. Let's go. And then we put this guy in the retirement home. Super Guard. Ooh. Oh, I went grilling today. I'm not gonna lie, I made some bomb ass hot dogs. Like, I boil hot dogs most of the time. Yeah, it gets the job done, it cooks. But when I tell you these dogs were cooking, oh my god. Holy shit, they were good. I struck first, not on my watch. You thought you could get me? No, 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 no. Oh, shit. Head of the pen. I mean, I don't think I'm anywhere close to losing. So, I don't think it's a big loss. Money. Maybe defeating every single enemy I see is not the schmoo. Battlebird! RDM registration. Rogue port direct mail service. Your time frame is referring to the third of you. Direct mail service providing regularly time news update. Published by the Restoration Committee. Okay. So, we have been streaming for two hours and six minutes. I think it is time to call it a quit. Next time, what we're going to be doing is we are going to hunt after Hooktail and hopefully finish chapter one. Now, 
for you. Be ready for the next time I stream or something like that. I do not know if this is going to become a video. If it does, until next time, you'll see some volleyball. You'll probably see some more Destiny 2, maybe some Fortnite. I will want to like kind of just like tone down with the Fortnite because I got to deal with some business. Some business is happening before the Destiny 2 stuff, and I also got to do the Destiny 2 stuff. So, yeah. So, I'll be seeing you. Peace. Oh, that's a wrong thing. That's...